What's up, guys? We are Tottenham TV here. Outside of Wembley, we're here with Daryl. The Spurs have been beaten 2-1 by Liverpool. What went wrong for you today? Everything, mate. Absolutely everything. Um, we didn't seem to like press enough of going forward. There was no real communication between the midfield and up front. Defence, I thought we were sound in defence. I thought you know, everything was going right. I thought Toby marshaled the defence brilliantly. You can't really blame Vaughan for the goals. But there was just seems to be no appetite. If we'd lost 2-1 today and we put we put a, lot of, yeah, a fair few amount of shots on target, I would have been all right with that. But we seemed to have no desire going forward. There was just nothing. It was just absolutely nothing there. I don't get it. We struggled to really get any passing moves, Theo, didn't we? They kind of live were pressing us so intensely. Do you think maybe we struggled a bit having three, like, kind of non-creative midfielders in that in that centre maybe we could have done with an attacking player absolutely definitely I think the Lamella should have Lamella probably should have started I do feel that and I don't I don't think Ericsson gives us anything in the attacking sense and saying that I don't think Addy does lately either we seem to have that Ericsson and Addy seem to be going through the motions they can have one good game and then three or four bad ones after that you don't, they're just drifting out of the game I don't get that why that's happening. They're supposed to be our uh, linchpins, if you like, to support Kane, but I can't, at the moment, it's Lucas doing that sort of work. But well, obviously now it's two losses in a row. How bad is this situation for you, or is it kind of, we can just pick ourselves up, go again against Inter Milan on Tuesday, and, you know, hopefully turn things around? Well, it's going to take a lot to, like, you know, get any sort of result from Inter Milan, mate. I mean, it's, it's, this, is, this is what you want to go for in the Champions League, though, but are we equipped enough to get through that group? I mean, I know we done it last season, but we needed signings this summer. We needed signings big time this summer. Two or three would have done, but to not even sign one. I mean, come on, even with the stadium cost and that, surely. We look today, we had players like Son, we had players like Lamella, we had players like Davidson Sanchez, Wanyama, all on the bench today. And those are good first team players, so it's not... Play the World Cup though, aren't they? Mate, that's the problem. Are we fatigued? Maybe, and the, the mistakes would say yes. Has this squad run its course? I don't know. I mean, I hope it, I hope it hasn't. Have we been found out? Do teams know how to play against well, maybe us? Maybe it's just a setback which we can overcome in this game. I'm hoping so, mate, because two defeats out of the first five isn't really good reading. It's not as good reading as what we would have expected by now. I'm, I'm still very hopeful that we can, like, you know, claw the top four this season, but it's going to be hard. I mean, there are so many teams now that can definitely finish top four above us. Looking at Liverpool today, how many levels above us do you think they are? Do you think they're quite hard? I, I think Liverpool, to be honest, uh, if Man City ain't going to win the league, it's going to be Liverpool, without any shadow of a doubt. Uh, any shadow of a doubt. I can't see Arsenal. I'm not being biased, but I can't see Arsenal finishing top four. I just can't see it. I reckon the... I don't know. It's a, it's a weird one. It's a very weird one. Uh, top four should be secure. But if we keep having results like this, it's not going to you. I mean, I'm hoping so. We've got Cardiff, what is it, Cardiff next to the league? Brighton, I believe. Brighton, Brighton well, away from home? Yeah. Right, yeah, OK. Well, that should, be, that should be three points, really. And then Cardiff after that, and, you know, it should be six points dead set there. Well, I say it should be, but this is Tottenham, exactly, isn't it? Never this know. is Tottenham. <laughs> All right, well, this point in day, but cheers for coming Thank on, Thank you, down. mate. No nice worries. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>